Well, good morning. I'm going to try to demonstrate how to set up vMix with a desktop capture on one display and you can move your cursor from uh, scene to scene and your cursor will show up on top of your second scene. In this case, uh, from a weather scenario, it's going to be a radar uh, application. Right now I have vMix uh, loaded up and uh, over here, I've just got my camera that's video in this event and my audio, my microphone that's recording it. So the first step, open vMix and uh, then you want to uh, open your uh, radar and see I minimized vMix then and made it smaller on the screen over here. Now I'm going to open up, uh, in this case, I'm just going to open up Radar Omega since I like to follow that one and it popped up on my same display and uh and it may pop up smaller than you know makes who knows where it'll pop up but i make it as large as i can i move vmix i make vmix small as small as i can where i can still uh, uh maneuver and function with it because it's going to be the one that's the streaming uh software but I have made my radar application as large as I can uh, and what I want to do now is is go back to vMix to the add input button and that's going to bring up that screen in the middle that says select the video file to open well I'm going to go down to uh, NDI desktop capture click on that I'm going to choose desktop capture and you see now uh, you may have display one uh, you probably don't have display two since you don't have it but you'll have radar omega or gr level three listed there and then you'll have one or two vmix uh, uh, icons in that screen you do not want to click on gr level three or in this case radar omega because it will not allow you to uh, display your cursor you go over to display one, which in your case, I think, Bo, display one is what you will have. You click on that and you select OK. And you will see your module that you created in vMix. And I'll make that larger for you right now. Uh, under desktop capture shows the entire desktop uh, that you have uh, up. Minimize that back down and you'll see your radar application in the center of it. Now what you want to do now is basically you're going to crop out everything else but the radar and you're going to make that larger so that gear icon in the bottom right hand corner of that desktop capture module click on that and then choose position. Now when you get to position you, you see your desktop capture in that screen down at the bottom you can take your clicker and right click on that and move it anywhere you want to in there. If it's not in the center, your radar is not in the center, then put it in the center, then go up to the zoom slider and start making that larger and larger. If it goes off screen, you can go back down there and position it right in the middle of your screen. And when you get that like you want it to, then X out of that and you'll notice the module now in vMix shows desktop capture. Now, I have my cursor, you may not, you probably can't see that. If you look closely, you can. My cursor is moving around that. I'm going to quick play that up to my output module right there. And uh, you see that now in the top right hand module of vMix. That is the module that's going to be actively streaming out. Now, if you move your cursor off of the vMix screen over to your radar screen, then you see you can see your cursor there as you uh, as you talk about the broadcast or you talk about in this case here the uh, severe thunderstorms down in Jackson Mississippi you can zoom in with your mouse there and bring it in closer you can you can do whatever you want to do there now if you and you talk about your storms and you see your cursor there and that makes your presentation more effective and when you want to go back to vmix and you want to change any type screen that you have up then you simply go and uh, quick play each of those or either single click and uh, send it up into the preview and then uh, transition it over i'm going to demonstrate just my camera shot here i'm going to single click my first module here that puts the uh, 
uh, that into that preview module and maybe I want to talk about that and be on camera and wave at everybody then there we are there if I want to go back to the the radar again then we go over here and we can go through the same scenario um, so that helps I hope it does if not let me know and I'll try to fine-tune it <laughs>